Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Nemesis and our weekly episode about NFT. So today we are here in Switzerland with Roberto Gorini to know more about uh, his project called uh, Crypto Heroes. Hi, Amelia. It's a pleasure to meet you here physically in Lugano. <laughs> yeah, <finally. laughs> yeah, finally, finally, yes. So, Roberto, can you please explain us your video game? Okay, our video game is an NFT game uh, based on our blockchain, Noku chain, uh, specifically designed for NFT gaming. Uh, so you uh, you will have your NFT card uh, on your wallet. Uh, you can buy it uh, or you can receive it uh, by airdrop or you can receive uh, from another account, uh, your friends. And uh, then you have to put your NFT on the platform, on the smart contract that allow you to play Crypto Eros against the other user. You can play with uh, cryptocurrency against other cryptocurrency or with uh, some uh, VIP person of uh, the cryptosphere. So how the, the game does that work? So um, every, every card, every NFT has a, um, a performance. Uh, that is the same performance that the cryptocurrency has in the market in that moment. Uh, so Bitcoin is, uh, has a, his own performance and uh, Ethereum has another performance. You have to, com you have to uh, put in your deck 12 cryptocurrency or 12 NFT and have the maximum performance possible against the other user. Uh, the user that will have the uh, performance, uh, the higher performance, will win the match. The match, um, the duration of a match is about four hours, uh, from two to four hours, depends on the match. And uh, why did you choose to use the, the Noku chain and not uh, Ethereum, for example? Because the fee, because it's impossible to play an NFT game right now in the Ethereum blockchain uh, because the fee are very expensive and uh, also the velocity of the, um, the blockchain uh, doesn't allow you to play uh, an NFT platform, an NFT, an NFT game. So we develop our blockchain and uh, that is a, a POA a blockchain, uh, is an Ethereum virtual machine also, but it's a POA blockchain and uh, it's very fast and uh, the fee are uh, close to zero. So we recorded another interview with you a few months ago and I wanted to ask you, can you please let us know what happened in the crypto era since, uh, since then so we can make an update? of that interview? Yeah, at that time uh, Crypto Heroes was in beta version, now it's official, everybody can uh, play Crypto Heroes. We have official tournament with, with uh, a lot of prize. Uh, every match has a um, Noku prize and some special car prize. And, um, and we, in, uh, we add some future that we haven't uh, in, uh, in April, I think April, and uh, like uh, team. You can play in a team, not, not alone, but in a team. And uh, the team that uh, has the best performance have an additional score of the match. And how many cards did, did you publish since then? Or how many cards do you publish each month, for example? Since then, we published 150 cards, new cards. We will have uh, more or less 20, 30 cards per month. And... Um, more or less 500 cards per year. So every year we will uh, uh, publish uh, new cards. Okay. And um, how many cards will exist in, uh, in total to complete the collection? Right now, 500 for this year, but uh, next year will be 1,000. So basically you will add more cards, but uh, these cards are cryptocurrencies or influencer of the crypto world. Right? Exactly. Yes. So you have to find more influencers. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> We find a lot of influencers in the crypto sphere, but uh, we have also card uh, with technology. We have, for example, a Lightning Network card, mm -hmm. Second Layer card, ASIC cards, uh, uh, Schnorr Signature cards, etc. And for antagonist, what, which card do you have? Usually the antagonists are the fiat currency. Mm -hmm. The fiat currency, and so we found a lot of fiat currency, and also some other problems like uh, war, uh, pan pandemic, uh, fair, etc. 
And uh, um, you mentioned you would do a nice drop of your uh, NFT cards. Yeah. So who would be eligible to, to have your cards? Uh, when you open a new Noqua account, you will receive 20 card airdrop. So 20 new cards to play Crypto Heroes immediately because to play Crypto Heroes, you, you need 12 cards. So you will receive 20 cards. And uh, for every match that you play, you will receive every week another one card. Okay. And uh, we will do some uh, uh, events like this one. And uh, inside the events, you can have uh, a special eye drop, uh, like in this case. Okay, we will talk about it uh, in a minute. In the meantime, you can see the, the website on the, on the footer of the video, so you can go and check the noku.io, so you can uh, sign in and uh, try to, to play and uh, get your uh, airdrop. And um, what about regarding the, the rewards? What people uh, can win when they actually win the, the, the card video game? For every tournament, we have uh, some reward. Um, for example, for this tournament that started today, it is called Cryptonomist. You will have a uh, 1000 Noku uh, for price uh, and uh, some special card like Crypto Hero, that is a very important card for the game, and uh, an other uh, two cards like Cryptonomist and uh, Amelia Tomasicchio cards. And uh, uh, you will receive some pack, free pack of the card because uh, you can buy the pack, but you can win the pack of Crypto Heroes. How many users do you have right now? Right now we have more than 500 users, and if you, if you see the, the past match, you can see that more or less we have from 50 to 100 players for every match. And apart from the, the Cryptonomist tournament, do you have any other tournament right now? No, the, right now we have only the Cryptonomist tournament. After the Cryptonomist tournament, we will have some other uh, tournament. Okay, and um, so how can people uh, claim their uh, airdrop uh, regarding this tournament for Cryptonomist? Everybody can click uh, uh, the landing page, the link uh, down this uh, video probably. And uh, if you have not uh, your NOC account, you have to register for a NOC account and then you will receive uh, the airdrop directly on your wallet of the Noco account. And in the meantime, we are watching the, the gallery dedicated to Noco on the Nemesis. Yeah. So we can see, for example, the, the Warren Buffett Warren uh, cards <laughs> that is an antagonist, of course. Of course. Yes. I see CJ, Dogecoin, yeah. Cyberpunk. Cyberpunk is a jolly card. Okay. Yes. Uh, CZ cards. Why is it jolly? It's jolly, uh, uh, it's a multiplier of uh, uh, the other cards. Mm -hmm. So, for example, if you have cryptocurrency that made a uh, ten percent of uh, performance, a jolly can double the performance to twenty. Okay, so thank you very much for uh, this interview. Uh, after this video, we will leave you with the with a tutorial to use uh, Noku. So keep watching the video to know more on how to play and how to sign in on Noku the Thanks a lot, Roberto. Thank you, Amelia. See you soon. Bye bye. Bye.